Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. After witnessing such a grim scene, 
We have got to go race over to Zelda with a very injured Midna on our back. Let's do this. As you can see, I am Wolf Link in Normalville. So what's up with that? Well, it has to do with that crystal that you've seen that got embedded in my head. Well, Link's head, not my head. Of course. <laughs> This is probably one of the scariest scenes in the game. Just because of the fact that you could lose your companion and whatnot, you get the idea. And we have to get there quickly. Oops, one more over there. Wait, 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 wait. Still one more. There we go. I got a little confused on the map based on where my positioning on the arrow was. I always think that I'm like at the tip of the arrow, but I'm actually more like at the very center of the arrow. arrow. <laughs> I know the feeling. I mean, I'm not wearing any clothes. I'm cold. I'm wet. Whoa, 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 wait, wait. I took a wrong turn. I'm supposed to go back over near Telma's bar. So I can go through. Well, I could have gone the other way, I suppose. I'm being followed by cats everywhere. You would think that they would be frightened with... You know, from a dog or something, but no, or it seems like we're all friends. I guess there was a time period when they realized it was all just a big misunderstanding, and then the war between dogs and cats once again started, and it just turned terrible. But anyway... <laughs> go through here and wait a second oh, oh, oh I'm supposed to go in I think no but that does show that scene <laughs> oh, I was supposed to go in there to trigger it no one though I remembered I have to had to go in there <laughs> Why, yes, how can you tell? The scent. Poor Midden, now you can hear her breathing heavily. This is one sophisticated cat. Uh, perhaps I'll explain later. There's a passageway over here. And that's why I'm here. Unfortunately, I can't jump like this cat can. So I'm going to need the assistance of... A crate! Always there when you need one. Grab it and push it over. And get up. Upsy daisy and through the window. Wait, wait. What else do you have to say before I go up there? Because this is one of those exclusive scenes. I already got it. <laughs> but thanks anyway. And through this window we go. And this leads us to... the upper part of Telma's bar. Why do we want to go through here? Well, this place leads to Hyrule Castle. Well, it's like a back door to Hyrule Castle. Do not push any of those things off, otherwise you'll get, I mean, they'll get alerted and they'll chuck you out. <laughs> Just saying. And I, I never been able to tell, but it's, I don't think that's... I mean, that could be blood on her back, but it doesn't look like that's blood on her back, actually. And, oh boy, this is the start of quite the quest. First, let's talk to Giovanni here. So, use your senses. Remember that lantern we seen back at Hyrule Field? 
um, west of the uh, Hyrule Castle Town. It's one of these things. And you must do a finishing attack to rip out its soul. There are a total of 60 of these in the game world, and they are this game's gold skull to laws. Yes! Those again! Well, sort of. You're welcome. Since there's not as many, they aren't nearly as annoying, and they aren't nearly as annoying to get in general, so yeah. Oh, poopers! Sure. So I guess check back here once you get 20 of the critters. But anyway, he opens a treasure chest, and this leads you... Yep. And going down here, drop. Leads you back to... You recognize this place, right? Yeah, it... Oh, jeez. The rats are back to normal, but they're still just as annoying. <laughs> this... Well, actually, this is a new place, too. Open this. Go out! There really isn't anything over there, anyway. <laughs> This is back at the sewer system of Hyrule Castle, but it's a different path through it. And we got a skull to lot, which we're going to have to deal with in a different way. Because I can't use my sword, we actually have to time our strikes this time, or go around to the back, that works too. Now you'll notice that there's a spider web there. You remember having to do this before, back at uh, the second Twilight Realm? Yeah, we're doing that again. <laughs> And, oops, I want to dash, not throw it, but whatever. I'll just keep my stick with me. There's another thing that I have to burn. Uh, it's actually up. Uh, I should probably kill off the enemies first. And do I have to... Oh, I have to light that torch so I can get some leeway on here. Because of the fact that uh, the torch is burnt out before you have a chance at... Uh, getting up to that spider web, so you gotta light a few other torches on along the way. Uh, it's not so much a torch so much as it is a stick, but I guess you turn it into a torch. <laughs> but it's not traditionally built as a torch, anyway. And, oh, okay, I guess I can light them that way as well. <laughs> Never thought of that before, actually. I just ran across it and it worked. Now, climb up. Get up there in time, get up there in time. There we go. And hop down. Oh, there goes my fire. It's too bad. And through this passageway we go. I'm not really even going to be bothering with the enemies. I mean, come on, we have a sick patient on our back. We've got to get going. So, now you see this hole on the ground here. Uh, you know what, I'm going to do this. Oh, and I can't do it because of uh, Midna on my back. She's the one that gives me the power to do that, that homing attack to everything. Anyway, since here and dig through here. You'll actually dig to another layer. And this is the area that we know, I mean that we knew before as the sewer area. Uh, oops. I'm supposed to climb, not jump into the water. Oh! Hate those guys. <laughs> I'd rather snipe them from a distance, but you just can't do that in wolf form. And, uh oh. Oh, you're not a shoot, but never mind. You just got a club. Uh, I'll go across here. I think it's going to be a bit safer. Hopefully. <laughs> Don't worry, Midna. We'll meet up with Zelda. And notice that there's more ropes than there were the last time for some reason. I guess they decided to install more this time or something like that. So let's just use the ropes to get up there. We can't use Midna to hop up there. Maybe they anticipated Midna's uh, injury, but well, I guess they did a pretty good job of that. <laughs> I'll just skip that one. It seems faster to go around the perimeter like this rather than to go across the ropes, even if the enemies might be on on land sometimes when you drop from above. Just keep tightrope walking. Uh-oh. How am I going to deal with you? I guess like that. <laughs> you can jump from the rope to attack them, I suppose. And now since I... Ah! Now since I can't get up there to the upper level, I'm just going to use the door, which is now open for 
whatever reason, and that takes us through the normal path. That, uh, for some reason, we couldn't take before because it was closed off, and here's the crate we pushed last time. Surprisingly, the door is open now. Despite, you know, it pouring rain, <laughs> as opposed before. And that's the regular form of the card rock, by the way, not the shadow version of it. Just thought I would make a mention of that. And wait, 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 wait. Do I keep... How do I get a... Oh, right, that's right. I have to use... Whoops! <laughs> I have to wait for the wind to make the bridge flow upwards. How far back am I? How far back... Oh, jeez. Way back here. Well, I, I guess it's not that far back. Yeah. Alright, so wait here to make sure you got a full gust of wind in your favor. And make the jump. And surprisingly, you can walk on here with the wind. <laughs> the wind is just that powerful to hold up a wolf, I suppose. And... I should say a wolf on a bridge. You know what? I'm gonna skip it. I'm just gonna go through this window and meet up with Zelda. Hurry! Wait, wait, hearts! Oh, never mind. <laughs> There's always hearts in those crates. Oh, looks like she's gone. Or is she? Ninja! Thank you. 